All right, so here we are on my Gmail account. What you wanna do to create a signature in Gmail is go over here to settings, click on it, and then click see all settings. So the first option under settings. Once you get under here, there are a ton of different options for things. Um, there are some options up here, but we're gonna stay under general. And you're gonna scroll down all the way until you see signature appended at the end of all outgoing messages. I currently don't have any signatures, but we will go ahead and create a new one. So this is what happens when you create a new one. So you can hit this button. It's gonna ask you to name the signature. So I will just put test and create. So once you create a name for your signature, you can type whatever you want to in here, doing digital with Megan, or type whatever. You can also add a link. So doing digital with Megan, you can add a, you can highlight this and add a link. So I can do doing digital with Megan.com. And if someone were to click on that, they would go to my website. But the whole point of this is to show you guys how to do an email signature. So you would need to hit insert image, but this is the issue that happens when you create, when you try to create like a um, photo signature, a photo email signature in Gmail. You have to upload it, let's see. I would say you have to upload it to Google Drive, which I have open, you can do it that way. I'll show you how to do that, or you can upload it from here. So what we need to do is go back into our design, save it, and then drag and drop it into here. So I've already got this signature pulled up right here. I'm gonna go ahead and download it. Um, I'm gonna download it as a PNG. Um, make sure to download it as a PNG without the transparent background or um, a JPEG, either of those work. So we're gonna download it as a PNG. It's gonna take just a minute but it should come up shortly. Also, my cat is like really getting on my nerves. So if you hear him meowing in the back, I promise I'm not being mean to him. He's just, just being extra whiny today. So um, I'm gonna rename this as test email signature. Okay, so now it's saved and it popped up down here. So let's go back over here to our Gmail and we're gonna drag it and drop it. Okay, and now that we've dragged it and dropped it, this is what we're going to see. So you can do it that way. I've found that that's the easiest way to do it. Um, if you already have it uploaded into your Google Drive account, then you would just need to insert image and go to, um, go to My Drive and <clears throat> all images will show up right here. You'll just pick the image um, that you wanna use as your signature and upload it that way. You can also do a web address. So if you use something like Photo Bucket, um, Pixabay, or something like that, then you can always find the picture and use the URL for that um, if you wanna do it that way. But honestly, just dragging, dropping it, and doing this is the best way. So, um, I'm actually going to, let's see, signature defaults for new emails use. Um, so this defaults category right here. So for new emails, use no signature, or you can drop down and do the test one that we just created. Um, on reply, so if you reply to someone's message, as of right now, there's not gonna be any signature, but if you want a signature, then you can do test. I'm just gonna keep it no signature. Um, and then we don't need to change anything else. We're not going on vacation or doing anything. So we'll hit save changes. And I'm going to compose an email. And when we go to compose an email, this is what it's going to look like. So you can do the message to someone and you can do, um, thank you, geez. All right, thank you for watching today's
video, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more Canva tutorials and tips. Insert smiley face here. Okay, so this is what it's gonna look like if I were to send it to someone, I'm not gonna send it to anyone. Um, I just wanted to show you guys an example of what that's gonna look like. This is what the finished product would look like. It is a little blurry and this honestly is the first time I've ever tried this out. So I don't know why it's very blurry, but if you know why it's very blurry and how to fix that, I would appreciate you dropping a comment and letting me know how to do that. But that's how you would add it into Gmail. Um, now, as far as like if you use Yahoo or AOL or some other kind of email service, um, you just have to dig around and go into settings and it's pretty similar, but I'm not gonna show you how to do it there. Um, if you would like for me to make a tutorial on how to upload this into you know, Yahoo or another email account service or email service, then let me know. But I hope this helped you guys out. Um, if you have any questions or anything for me, make sure to leave them in the comment section below and I will see you guys again soon.